is a great leader and one of the biggest leaders in the country when it comes to provision of care to the members of the LGBTQ plus community. We take a lot of pride in our work and we've been there for the community for over 20 years at this point. Depending on what you know, a um, couple we have in front of us and what the couples are coming for, there are so many different options uh, to build a family. For instance, if I'm seeing um, a lesbian couple, they really just need a little bit of sperm to get to the right place, so it's quite simple. And then we assess which member of the couple, or maybe both members of the couple, would like to experience pregnancy. Co-IVF is a specific approach that allows both uh, partners who happen to be people with ovaries to biologically participate in um, creation and birth of a child. And what that really entails is that one member of a couple would undergo controlled ovarian stimulation, or IVF as we call it, um, egg retrieval, then those eggs would be um, fertilized by usually donor sperm, which can be either anonymous donor or a friend or a family member, which we call designated donor. Uh, once embryos are created from these eggs, then we would use an embryo and transfer that embryo into the uterus of the other member of the couple, who then gets to experience the pregnancy. So this really gives the opportunity for both members of the couple to be physically and biologically involved in, in creation and in the delivery of their child.